Okay, so you were taking your first introductory computer science class, mm -hmm. and you had no background, right? Mm -hmm. It was a blur, a whirlwind. <laughs> so was that like okay <laughs> or not really, or what was that like? I came in thinking that if you were going to do computer science, you were going to go all the way, you were going to be a software engineer at Google, or at Facebook, or at Microsoft, and that there was no middle path. Um, I didn't really expect to make anything of my computer science skills because I didn't see myself as someone who was going to fill those roles and so there was really no, no reason to pursue that further. I thought I was going to take the introductory course and just end there. And I think I came out of it um, understanding that tech means a little bit more than maybe what you'd initially perceive or what I initially perceived. Um, again, I, I thought it was these, these roles that Facebook, Google, Microsoft, um, and that was it. Um, but now I think I see the opportunity for tech in so many other fields. Um, and it doesn't have to be like all you do, yeah. um, but it can just be this toolbox that- Oh, I like tools. that, a toolbox. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and so I wanna do economics, um, and I'm very interested in the power of data, data manipulation, data visualization, um, like mining data from interesting sources. Um, I would consider the things I care most about to be development economics and behavioral economics. There's just a really interesting focus now on data and quality of data and quantity of data. Um, there was an awesome um, book written by an economist who got his hands on Google data and there's just so much interesting. Um, I think I remember so you telling me about this, that people are like really honest with Google, yeah, right? Yeah, they are. <laughs> and so there's so many interesting findings that have come out of that um, because Google is such an such a unique source of data. Um, right. So there's this great emphasis on data and I think that really intersects so nicely with computer science. Mm -hmm. And that's what I came out of it with. Um, yeah. Was that this like actually matters for what you care A surprising intersection. <laughs> yeah, a surprising intersection between what I actually care about and this interesting toolbox that I got. I remember there was this problem set we did. It was Twitter and we were pulling tweets from the website and then yeah. trying to analyze what kind of language was used. Um, but when I reflect back on it, it's not that I want to be pulling tweets and analyzing those, but those skills um, mm -hmm. actually at my workplace um, that is working on um, evaluating different interventions in the realm of anti-poverty work and trying to determine what works best. And so they're doing a seven year follow-up now on an intervention that they did. And they're very excited um, because they might implement this piece where they're trying to analyze in a very similar way to that problem set, um, the kind of language that people use when they talk about their future. Mm, okay, okay. And so, oh, so it's like kind of basically what you did in this like intro computer science exactly. class now applied to where you actually exactly, work Exactly, but it's within my field and it's exactly yeah. what I find interesting. Yeah. Um, and it's just lifting this one tool, not the yeah. context, but the tool itself yeah, yeah. Um, to augment what I want to do. Oh, I really Which like I'm very that. excited about. Oh, that's yeah. so exciting. Mm -hmm. Wow, yeah. cool.